There are around 400 ohms left in the world, and one of them survived without food for several years. It almost sounds impossible for a creature to stay still and survive years without eating. But scientists have studied this group of blind amphibians over the span of 10 years. One in particular didn't even move or eat for an entire period of 7 years. We are talking about ohms, also called baby dragons. Ohms are cave-dwelling aquatic salamanders found in the subterranean freshwater lakes and streams of the limestone caves in the Daenerik Alps. Ohms have evolved to go long periods without food. They can consume a lot of food all at once and store excess nutrients for periods of time when access to food is limited or impossible. This special skill allows them to survive without eating for up to 10 years depending on their conditions. The cave salamander has tiny teeth, but it seems that it doesn't even chew its food. Instead, it swallows its prey whole. Even when full, ohms consume hardly any energy and have a very low metabolism. Having adapted to live in dark, wet caves, they usually don't change their location. Ohms, which have a slender, long cylindrical body, can measure about 25 centimeters or 10 inches. Their eyes, however, are so small and underdeveloped that they do not even extend beyond the skin's surface, which renders them almost blind. Because ohms live in permanently dark environments and do not rely on their vision, they have developed a very advanced sensory system. Their highly sensitive chemoreceptors allow them to detect species of prey in the water around them, and their ears can pick up sounds from the water and the ground. Some studies even suggest that ohms are also able to detect and orient themselves to magnetic fields. Ohms lack pigmentation, and their skin is usually creamy white or light pink, which coined them the name human fish. But when exposed to light, they can turn dark violet or black. This color change can be reversed once the ulm is back to its dark habitat. Ulms are known to conduct a very secretive lifestyle and live in undisturbed and unfrequented environments. They occupy caves that are inaccessible to humans and live in spaces under rocks and inside cracks. Scientists have used them as a model to study the evolution of sensory adaptations in aquatic environments where there is little to no light. There is still little information about their behavior and lifespan in the wild but scientists believe they breed every 12 years on average and reach sexual maturity at 15 years of age. They are also believed to have an astonishing life expectancy of over 100 years. Scientists have been able to conclude those facts by observing the Ulm's population in captivity. The average age of an Ulm in captivity was about 70 years. Unlike axolotls, which are popular among aquarium enthusiasts and are fairly easy to take care of, Ulm's cannot thrive in captivity since it's very hard to mimic the conditions of their natural habitats. It is also illegal to capture ohms, and they are banned from the pet industry. Ohms are currently listed as vulnerable on the IUCN Red List for Threatened Species. It is believed that there are only around 400 of them left in the world, and the main reason for their diminishing population is the destruction of their natural habitat. This includes water pollution as well as infrastructure and other construction projects above land. Currently, ohms are mostly found in national parks and land protected by the governments of Italy, Croatia, and Slovenia. As a very distinguishable and unique creature, ohms are a popular ecotourism attraction in the Daenerik Alps, and there are no known adverse effects of ohms on humans. Did you know that the ohm is one of Slovenia's national treasures and is featured on one of the country's coins? If you could only have one meal to last you 10 years, what would that meal be? Share your thoughts in the comment section.